2023, Prophet Ayodili tells Peter Obi things he must do to win the presidency. Hello everyone, thank you for joining us once again on the channel. We'd like to say a very big welcome to you. Now, if you are joining us for the first time, we'd like to say welcome. Please do well to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Now, to all of our existing subscribers, we want to say thank you so much for your support. We appreciate your cooperation on the channel. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up on our post as they come your way. Thank you and God bless you. Now, on today's report, we see that the prophet Ayodele of the Envy Evangelical um, Spiritual Church is saying that um, giving Peter will be advices on things he must do to actually win the 2023 election. Now, if we recall, we know that um, Primate Elijah Ayodele has actually at one point um, said that God had actually told him who will become um, Nigeria's next president. Well, now that he is telling Peter Obi what to do, does that mean um, that he is actually telling us that the predictions for the winner for um, the 2023 elections is um, Peter Obi? Well, we'll get to see that. Um, if you recall, at some point he said that God was against the Muslim Muslim presidential ticket of um, the APC, and he actually said that um, God will go against also the pastors who are supporting um, the Muslim Muslim ticket. And we know that um, at another point he actually said that um, the struggle for the presidency um, was between Peter Obi of the Labour Party and then um, Atiku um, Abubakar of the PDP. And he said that um, um, APC's um, presidential candidate, Bola Tinubu, was actually out of the struggle for the 2023 um, presidential election. And according to him, he said that um, it was God that would decide who actually becomes the next president of Nigeria. And he, according to in that statement, he said that God was not actually going to look at any religion or zone in deciding um, Nigeria's next president. And he said that it was between Peter Obi and Atiku, and they were the ones struggling for it. And he doesn't see Tinubu getting anywhere. And he also warned and urged Nigerians to be careful because um, anything would actually happen and that the elections could actually cause problems and chaos and that um, it could be more sensitive than what we expect or what we have even ever seen um, before and he said that God would actually pick between these two candidates that are struggling for it and that it is a big struggle that and that Nigeria was going to be better um, after all of this well now we see that he is telling Peter Obi things he must actually do to win the election well is he speculating or is he actually proclaiming that peter obi is actually going to win well we know prophet ayodile to be one who has said um, a lot of prophecies in the past and some of those prophecies have actually come through has speculated well let's go into the details of today's report and let's see what he is telling the labor party presidential um, candidate to do in order to win the elections the leader of the Inri Evangelical Spiritual Church, Primate Elijah Ayodele, has advised the Labour Party's presidential candidate, Peter Obi, things to do ahead of the 2023 presidential election. Primate Ayodele advised Obi not to work on the crowd alone, but on the election technicality. He urged Peter Obi to focus more on technicalities than crowd if he wants to win the election. Now, in a statement by his media head, Oluwa Tosin Osho, the clergyman said, 
Obi should not work on the crowd alone. He should work on the election technicality. He doesn't really need to work on reports, but results. He should be more diplomatic and technical. He will understand what I am saying. If he wants to win, he must make his focus from the crowd and work seriously on the election technicality. Primate Ayodele dismissed claims that there may be a runoff. Many things will still change before the election. Not all the crowd they are gathering will vote for them. They need to work extraordinarily. Let's forget about runoff or inconclusive. The winner will win and the losers would win, he said. Well, that is what um, Primate Ayodele has to say. And he is saying that if Peter Obi actually wants to win the 2023 presidential election, that he must take his focus from the crowd and work seriously on the election technicality well ayodele now did not express what he actually means by um election technicality but according to him he said that peter obi actually will understand what he is saying and that um, peter obi really needs to work on reports not on reports but that he should work on results and that um, peter obi should be more diplomatic and technical and that um, he should just work on the election technicality now we'd like to hear your thoughts we'd like to hear your opinions what do you think is um primate ayodele actually right on all of this he is saying is he actually trying to give us a message here that is this a prophecy is this another prophecy that is not being said straightforward or is this just his way of um, trying to show that this is the candidate that he endorsed or who is actually endorsing for the 2023 elections? And he is saying that um, not all of the crowd which have been gathered by the various political candidates and political um, parties will actually vote for them. Um, come the 2023 elections and he's saying that a lot of things will actually change and he's saying that the, the, let's forget about runoff and inconclusiveness for now that whoever will win will win and whoever will lose will actually um lose and that and um, these political various political candidates and parties just need to work extraordinarily well that's all of the details we can take on today's report until we'll come your way next time with more news happenings around the country do well to stay safe bye bye